Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how to root Vienna Ensemble multi outputs into Logic Pro. So let's get started. First off, we're going to have to initiate a track. Go up to Track, click on New, or you could use your key command Option, Command, N, and that'll get you the track dialog box. Make sure your software instrument button is checked, and also Go up and make sure multi timbro is checked. And you'll see the number of tracks will change to 16. And click on create. I'm going to click cancel because of my track list. I already have my MIDI instrument with its 16 channels. Now we're going to assign our Vienna Ensemble multi outputs. Scroll over to plugins, down to AU instruments, Vienna Ensemble. Multi Output 16 Stereo. There'll be three windows that open up. One will be Vienna Ensemble Server Interface, which is this one right here. The next will be Vienna Ensemble Service. Then we have our main Vienna Ensemble window. We're only going to be concerned with this window here. I'm going to take these windows and I'm just going to slide them out of view. Okay, we're ready to add our instrument channels and there's two ways of doing this. You can click on the buttons in the left hand bottom corner and that's alright doing it this way but there's an easier way to do it. You could use a keyboard shortcut which is Command N to load these instruments in a lot easier. I'm loading 16 instruments for our 16 MIDI channels. Okay, and now we're ready to assign our outputs for these channels. Okay, we're not going to be concerned with these buttons on the left hand side. These are for MIDI coming in. We're only going to be concerned with the right hand button. This is for assigning MIDI channels going into Logic Pro. This first instrument channel strip we're going to assign to MIDI channel 1. The next one, before we do that, I like to assign all the top MIDI channels all together. It's a little bit easier. The next channel strip we're going to assign to 2, 3, MIDI channel 4, and so forth. Okay, now that we got these done, all 16 of them, you can now see in our instrument channel strip list our assigned mini channels. You can see 4, 5, 6, and so on. These are our assigned MIDI channels going into Logic Pro. Next, we're going to have to assign the auxiliary routing going into Logic, and you can do this underneath the fader of the instrument channel list. Instrument 1 is assigned to the master bus. We're going to change that and we're going to assign it to auxiliary 1 and 2. Next we're going to assign channel strip 2 to auxiliary 3 and 4, 5 and 6, and so on. You can see in the mixer the channel strips with the newly assigned aux outputs. You could also assign these outputs on the channel strips themselves. Back into Logic, our first software instrument track should be set to MIDI channel 1. Our second, MIDI channel 2. Our third, MIDI channel 3. And so forth. Okay, here in the mixer, this is our main software instrument channel strip. And from it, we're going to make our aux channels. This little button here with the plus sign, we're going to click on it to make our aux channels. I'll be adding 15 more of these and counting the main instrument channel strip. That'll be my 16 MIDI channels. Now that that's done, let's check our routing to auxiliary number one. 
As you can see, our input is Vienna Ensemble, and it's coming in on input three and four. Auxiliary two, Vienna Ensemble, five, six, and so on. The routing between Vienna Ensemble and Logic Pro is done. Let's load up some instruments. Activate the Vienna Ensemble window, and you could load any software instrument you'd like. I'll be loading up a string section. My favorite, Strings Appassionata. Channel Strip 1, we'll get violins. Channel Strip 2, we'll get violas. And so on. Let's name a few of these channel strips. Channel strip one, we'll name violins. And channel strip two, we'll name violas. Here you can see the four software instruments that were loaded. Okay, click the mixer button top left corner to open up the mixer. And you can see here's our string section that was loaded. Let's check and see if all our hard work paid off. 